Welcome to step four, getting started with Remote Desktop Manager Enterprise Edition, create your folder structure. Let's start by creating our organization structure. So you'll see we'll have top level folder, which are our root level folder. Our fictional company, Windjammer, has a help desk team and a service desk team. It also has two customers being Downhill Pro and Telemark. Now let's create our first folder. So go and edit, new entry, add folder, and I'll name it Windjammer. I'll then create our two customers being Downhill Pro and Telemark. So I now have three group level folder, one for my own company and two for our customers. It's one of our best practice to create top level folder as the base for a security system, since it will make it easier to manage security in the long run. Now let's add a little something that will help you to see the permission level of each of your folder with just a quick look at the navigation pane. So right click here and select column chooser and then select permissions. Double click on it to add it to your navigation pane. You'll see how handy it is later on. You're now ready for step five, create your default settings. 